All right, Javon, you're the new title holder of the 155 class. How does that feel? It feels real good. It feels really good. I put, I put in a lot of time and effort. For a minute, I was able to pull out because I had my back teeth full out. So, and I know he was a southpaw, and last time I saw him fight, he broke the dude's jaw, had a wire right shut. So I was going to pull out for Hezen because I didn't get my back teeth. They put my back teeth out. So I was like, you know what, just forget it. It's going to go out. So. Well, you drew some blood on him today. Tell me a little bit about the yeah, fight. It was. Well, I try to do the angle where you come down like that to come across. Fortunately, he did it good. He caught me with a nice spinning one, just like that. And me, Ryan, I guess that kind of woke me up. Was like, you got to do something, man. You're going to lose this fight. So I knew he had a lot of power in his hands. So I really tried to keep to my right because he's a southpaw. So his, his left is his, his dominant hand. So I really keep to the outside with that. What were you looking to do? I mean, did you think it was a pretty good matchup coming I into think, it? I think it was a really good matchup. I think it was a good matchup. I was, I, I mean, he had good, he had good boxing. And um, I was really watching for my body. I was working my condition, my core. It's the most thing. Most thing. Anybody can do a head shots, but a lot of, a lot of, like 80% of the fighters can't really take a body shot. I, I learned it from my last two title fights. I was winning the fight, but body shots, and I lost them. And that was in the fourth round. So I learned from those previous fights. What do you think about these O fights? I think they're really good. I think they're good. A good show and showing off Muay Thai. I really like it. Yeah. What role did the environment play? It was a good crowd tonight. The it was light. Good crowd. I had a lot of support on Facebook. Everything, just a lot of support and enthusiasm, and motivated us to stay in there and keep going. You know. So yeah. What's next for you? Are you going to be competing soon? Um, I, I might be in uh, September as the 50 in the Bronx, but I'm not sure. But I might be coaching. I might have a couple of fighters. I'm, uh, from some of my friends going up there. Some of them with their camp. So, whatever comes my way, I'm almost anything. Whatever comes my way. Great, thank you so much and congratulations. All right, thank you for your time.